Oh, and welcome. Some people at King Bolin got in touch there recently and said they were going to send me this uh, battery analyzer for analyzing 12, 6 and 24 volt batteries. As soon as they got in touch, I said, just send it. I easily refuse automotive products because I'm not a mechanic, but I think this has a good application and everyday use. This is a useful item uh, because if you've got a car, which I have two of, um, you can test the battery with this at any time to see what condition it's in. Now it's kind of late spring coming into early summer. A battery doesn't need to be in tip top form to start the vehicle, but coming into winter that could change. If a battery is just hanging on, you could get a rude awakening somewhere and be late for work over the head. Of side of the packet, it's got uh, decent leads and decent crocodile clubs in it. I suppose not, not too short. Also, the features of this are it's got uh, over voltage protection and it's got polarity reverse protection. If you put these in the wrong terminals, it's okay, no harm done. And it's 6, 12, and 24 volt compatible. That said, I'm going to take it out to one of my vehicles and see what, see what happens. Here we are, the engine bay of the say, Toledo. Um, so we hook these on, that's the negative, and that's the positive, and she lights up, and we have to select the type, which is 12 volts, and we'll have to look at the CCA of this battery, and clicked OK there. Saying that battery is good, so there's life on her yet. So, I'm going to try the one in the other car, see what it says there. Right, we're at the engine bay of the good old Skoda now, so I'm going to do the same again. This battery's been in for a while, so hopefully, it'll turn out all right. It's analyzing it, it's just saying good. I'm going to um, put these on the wrong way around just to see what the analyzer tells us then. No, it doesn't, doesn't light up. But it doesn't do it any harm as we've observed earlier because um, it's got protection against that. So I'll hook them on again to see if she lights up this time. Ah, she lights up okay. So all's good there. I find this light portable and easy to use even for the uninitiated you don't need to be a mechanic with a engineering degree to use this if you're a mechanic this could be a handy wee one to have around if you're a homeowner if you're a car owner it's probably got its place for you also if you want to buy this yourself i'm going to put a link in the description and pinned in the comment section so if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and check out my channel for all my other videos